How you doing? I'm Scott from New Camp here today at the Louisville Show, and we're gonna look at the Tag Boondock Edition. So come, let's take a look. Um, what we have here is a true teardrop trailer that we've really beefed up to take some of the uh, ruggedness of uh, off the road driving. Um, so if we wanna start visually on the outside, what we do is we start with an aluminum cage technology at the foundation of everything, and then we build from there up. Um, outside specifically to handle some of the off-road things, we've got these rugged off-road tires, we've got beefy diamond plate fenders. Um, as we move towards the front, we've got an extra rack on the front for a generator, for some gas cans. Um, you can see this diamond plate tub. Uh, this will house your battery, batteries, as well as the LP tank. We've got a special feature on the front of this platform which is designed specifically for a Honda 2000 watt generator as well. So all of your off-road needs are taken care of. One other power um, point to make would be that uh, this unit can come solar equipped as well. So up to 100 watts. We've got a front opening window custom designed. All of our windows are uh, custom made for us from Europe um, and they're dual pane acrylic for extra insulation. As we continue to move around, you can see we've got roof rack, we've got some LED spot lighting on the top, uh, and on the roof rack we've got mounted an awning. So that'll come standard on the Boondock Edition as well. This is the Lagoon table. It gives you the ability to move around for your convenience, whether you're just going to have a little extra prep table in addition to what you've got back here in the galley, or if you're hanging out and you just want to keep, put a couple beverages on the side. So as we do move around through the back, you can see we've got some uh, solar flex panels on the top. And then back here we've got the galley kitchen. One unique feature of the boondock is we've installed this light bar up here, and you can have that shining on your kitchen, or you can have it shining outward. So back in the kitchen, we have a sink stove combo, microwave oven, and then we've got a cooler, 12 volt cooler chest. Um, it's a refrigerator, it gets down just, below, just above freezing, so you can have things nice and chill. All the lighting on this unit is LED, and then we've got cable coax, your electric, outdoor shower, and then your fill tanks. You might wonder what these are. This is to bring fresh air into the unit, but specifically into the air conditioner. So, as we peek inside, you can see some cargo netting here on the door, store some extra gear. TV, DVD in there. Below that is the air conditioning. And that air conditioning system will draw fresh air in from both sides, as well as from the cabin. And then we have a special exhaust through the floor. But it's 5,000 BTUs, so if you've got electric and it's a hot day, that thing will be an ice box. All of our cabinetry, we make in-house. It's real wood. Um, it's, about, it's highest level that you can get in an RV. It's uh, furniture quality. Um, as you can see, we've got a screen shade system as well. And uh, we've got a four inch mattress with underbed storage. Great place to store shoes, uh, extra gear, fishing poles, whatever you have. Um, this is a six and a half foot bed. And uh, side to side, this unit measures just about uh, 70 inches on the interior. The weight of this unit would come in around uh, about 1,200 pounds. And if you look towards the front, inside, you've got a uh, headboard and you've got sliding doors on it. Just store some more items in there. You've got power outlets, USB ports, and LED lighting on the strip back there uh, for your convenience. Finally, you've got a couple storage cubbies overhead. And then up on the ceiling, you have a three-way, dual directional, uh, fantastic fan. So this guy, he'll take care of all your needs. It's simple camping, but we give you everything and the kitchen sink to do it with.